Hello all. Welcome to another video at Craving Minds. About a month ago, we had posted a video on the 14 ways which can help you stay safe from the novel coronavirus. Today's video is a quiz based on that video. If you have already seen that video, then please do continue watching and try to answer the questions. If you have not seen that video, then I suggest you to click on the link above. Please do stay with us till the end. If you are not subscribed to our channel yet, then please do subscribe. Question 1 In the given picture who is wearing the mask in the correct way Number 1 Carol 2 Anne 3 Mike and 4 all of them Question 2 Ria and Rahul are going to cut vegetables to prepare their lunch Before cutting the veggies, what are they supposed to do? Number 1, wash their hands under running water. Number 2, sanitize their hands using a good hand sanitizer. Number 3, wash their hands using soap and water. Number 4, none of them. Question 3 Which one of these is a correct way of greeting in today's pandemic situation? Number 1 option A, number 2 option B, number 3 neither B nor A, number 4 both A and B. Question 4 Wilson and Katie want to remove their mask and then wear it again who is removing the mask in a proper way A Wilson B Katie C both of them D none of them Question 5 Kate and Emily were singing a duet in a competition yesterday. Do you think they are doing a right thing? Why? Question 6. In the given picture, do you think Jack can get infected with coronavirus? If so, Why? Question 7. Mary is busy working on her laptop and suddenly she felt like sneezing. Which is the correct way to do so? Picture A, picture B, neither B nor A, both A and B. Question 8 Which one of these combinations would help to boost your immunity Pictures A B C and D Pictures B A D and E Pictures D C B and E and pictures A D C and B Which one of these are not good sources of vitamin C that improves our immunity? Pictures A and D, 
pictures B and D, pictures C and D, or pictures A and B. Now, for the last question, question number ten. This question is a little different. It's in the form of a small story. So listen carefully. Jake, Emma, and Jamie are best friends. Because of the pandemic, they weren't able to meet each other for a couple of months. So when everything started to get normalized, they decided to meet up one day at a common place. On their way to a nearby coffee shop, they met another friend whose name was Aisha. They asked her also to join them for coffee. She agreed, and they all headed towards the coffee shop. They had only a few customers, and they were following all the COVID-19 safety protocols. They found a corner table, happily chatted with each other. and ordered for cold coffee cookies and donuts then the three of them went to the washroom to wash their hands before eating jamie sanitized her hands and they took off their masks before having the food while having the food nobody spoke much after that they called the waiter and paid the bills they spoke for some time even outside the restaurant and then they left for their homes Aisha had to buy some grocery for her mom and Jamie joined her. Then Jake and Emma went straight to their homes. Emma's sister Anna was waiting for her on the stairs inside their home. Emma took a chocolate from her bag and gave it to her. Then she went to her room and was feeling tired and so decided to take a small nap first. Jake wanted to play an online game. and so he went up to his room had a quick shower and changed his clothes meanwhile aisha reached her home kept her shoes and bag in their place and went to freshen up after that she started reading her favorite harry potter book jamie also reached home and she went straight up to her room tidied it and then changed her clothes thinking that she would bathe after a while She then found her baby brother crying and went up to him played for some time and both of them fell asleep there then she woke up and had early dinner with her mom now there are two questions whom do you think is likely to get infected with the corona virus it can be one person or more than one second question whom do you feel is least likely to get an infection now we have come to the end of the questions i hope you would like it i hope you all liked the video and were able to answer most of the questions correctly don't forget to leave your valuable comments in the comment box below Until our next video. Bye bye. Take care and stay safe.